Hey guys, welcome to the Retro Gaming Junction. This is Camilio, and uh, we're playing some Baldur's Gate base. Um, yeah. Well met. We can now recruit this guy. Yes, mm, I agree. We lose another this two points. With a swift kick in Peter Mart. And yeah, I looked it up. There's no easy way to. Uh, and it seems that it's kind of finicky how you lose uh, reputation. It seems to be the easiest way is to lose 10 points of reputation by killing one, someone, but that's just crazy. So fuck it. Um, let's level up this guy. Again, I'm not recruiting him forever, it's just to do his side quests. I'm just curious. Why can I put another point in that? Isn't he a fighter? And he's using two-handed sword also? Mmm, that's bad. Let's give you bastard swords. Two-handed weapon style. Yeah, he's focused on two-handed. He's a black guard. Oh, he's a black card, okay. Oh, he has his own weapon. Eh! What?! Is that cumulative?! Oh, okay, it's only one plus one. Wow. Oh man, that is some shitty equipment. Okay, we need to equip you. Yes? Must I watch over this group as a nanny, the child? Okay, that was the equipment for... I stand ready. It will be done. Oh, you must gather Magic your party not before venturing forth. Mind. It will be done. Sleep. They seem to max out at a certain level. The NPCs you get. You don't get NPCs at level 7, 8 or something like that. Hmm? With ease. Yeah. Knowing that, I would have done this mission a little bit early. I haven't played in a while, so I don't remember how bad it was, but do look at If Tugnukim would have been rated 97, it would have been better rated. Uh, no, I don't think so. Because it's really like comparable to things like Blood 2, which used the IP, but the game was just poor, so it didn't get good reviews. I played Duke Nukem Forever and it's a piece of shit. It's not as bad as people say it is, but it's just like your very, very, very average first person shooter. So it's not worth the price, it's not worth the IP, it's not worth your time. It's not, it, it wasn't worth the time of development. It's not worth it. I will require with ease. We have a bunch of fighters on our team now. Well in a tired mind, I must sleep. 
Matter wrecked. Stand ready. It will be done. With the I will require rest soon. Not a problem. And be gone with ease. I will listen. It shall be even bloodier than you hoped. Oh, yeah, there's this also. Oh, no, we can't either. Yeah, in terms of defense, uh, his low dexterity is really hurting. You know? Like, what happens if I put like, something like this on him? It goes to minus one, and with a ring, it could go to minus two or minus three. But we're at minus five and shit like that. Yes, we should be fine. Not a problem. His next mission shouldn't be too hard. Well, what's, Speak, what's his mission? Gone. What's his thing? Hmm? Will he give us a mission? Yes. Not a problem. No, we can't I stand ready. It will be hmm? not a problem. Okay, so I guess we just move around. With ease. Not a problem. We laid by enemies. Forward march. Magic does not. With ease. We shall hold here. You look tired. Okay. Quests. Wandered around with long, Dorn long enough. Okay. Shit. It will be done. Been waylaid by enemies with ease. Must ah! Ah! Go for the eyes, for you. Go for the eyes. Yes, not a problem. <laughs> Mr. Dorn does not want to talk to us. It will be done. It will be done. 
You have been waylaid by enemies. It will be done. Must defend you. No! You must gather your party before venturing forth. Go for the eyes, Boo! Go for the eyes! I will listen for now. Oh, for fuck. Yes? Don't! Don't! For right! Man! I need aid soon, lest my hamster become a dog. Cool one. I stand ready. Hmm? Not a problem. You have been waylaid by Not a problem. Oh, no. By the three. With ease. Yeah, let's rest. Hold. There you go. I would speak with you. What is it? Regarding my mission, I have a lead on one of my former companions, the Necromancer. Oh, I use the e e She was seen east of the Nashkel mines, but I know nothing more specific. I found a woman who knew where I could find Krill, but she did not respond well to my interrogation. Taris, as she is called, is somewhere in Nashkel. She was searching for her husband, or something like that. I do not commit such trivialities to memory. Nashko. It will be done. Stand oh. away, citizen! You can't do that. Oh, she's right there. Yeah. With ease. Start to work. With ease. Oh, you haven't seen them. I, I don't know very much about this area. I am looking for my husband, you see. He left me a week ago and, oh, the danger on the road and then that awful woman. I've been trying to find him ever since. Well, I don't really know. My husband has vanished. He was seen heading east in the company of some woman. I followed them for a while, but the wilderness became too dangerous. Please continue and do not leave anything out, even the smallest detail. When I asked some of the other people here in town, they said that the woman had lured several men away, not just my husband. I don't know what kind of game she thinks she's playing, but it isn't natural. Hmm. When I asked this woman about Krill, the description I gave matched the mystery woman who took away her husband. I demanded more information. She fled. Typical. That's really all I know. Somewhere to the east. Perhaps past the mines. Oh, I miss Hager so much. But I don't know if I could ever forgive him. Oh no! It's far too dangerous. I really don't know what to do. I have little Sounds money. Like you need a new my husband. husband is off with that wench. That horrible woman has stolen my... I do not. Krill was a necromancer of some ability, and she was, let us say, friendly enough at times. But she is not a leader of men. Something is amiss. East of Nashville. She said east of the mines. Not a problem. No, I'm gonna go here first. Not a problem. I serve the flaming fist. You may not rest. Yes, <laughs> what the fuck? Give us, give us victory! We shall hold here. You look tired. Oh. That is dope. Yes? 
Oh, the fuck. Ice Go for the ice! Rusk! I stand ready with ease. Whatever they need. Hmm? Not a problem. The undead rarely rise oh. up of their own accord. This business reeks of krill. Oh. Step carefully. Do you intend to kill her? I have dreamt of little else these past months. Ever since I was granted these new powers, the desire to drive my blade into the neck of each and every betrayer has driven me forward. I made a deal and agreed to certain conditions. I will speak no more on this matter. They can bill me. Hey, I they... thought you alone saw past my half-orc blood, Krill. Now I see you are just like the others. Perhaps Senjak was too handsome for you to ignore, but I've taken care of that. Someone had to take a fall to divert suspicion from the rest of us, and Simeon chose you. Besides, you obviously escaped. There's no need for revenge. It's beneath you, Dorn. Don't be so petty. Petty? You left me to die in Luskin. There will be no forgiveness. Stand and die, Krill. Once again, you fail to realize what's happening around you, Dorn. Rise up, my children. Rise up and feast upon the living. Oh. <laughs> I'm sitting with the guys like I'm part of them. <laughs> oh, and I'm panicked. Yes? Be direct. Go directly to her. What do you want? They wish my ear. Soon, and they mostly come at night. Mostly. Cool one, son. Kakzora. Good evening. Thanks for the host. By Temper Shield. Eh, fuck. Ah! And he's gone. <laughs> They're called. This group shows her. Don't promise. bother me. No, she's dead. Speak. Hmm. Ooh, what's this? I can see you suffer, Krill. I can see your soul writhe in the abyss. Of all my betrayers, you are the one whose pain pleases me most. I would assume that you speak metaphorically. Dorn, or can you really gaze into the abyss? Perhaps not literally, not with my eyes, but I do have channels of communication. Enough of this. Let us search the body. Hey. Whatever they need. What's this? It shall be even bloodier than you hoped. Oh. That note, let me read it. At last, Simeon the King bastard himself. Quickly, let us make haste. What are you doing? Wait a minute, what the fuck? What the fuck? What are you doing? You're stuck there now. You're 
You'll get out. You'll get out. Holy shit. And that is why I keep the door closed. Aren't you worried he you knows you're coming? You could be waiting with the trap. It tra matters not. I will escape any trap they lay for me. I will overcome any obstacle they place in my path. I know better than to trust the word of those I have slain already. But I sense it is true that he gave the order. Simeon must die. He invited Krill to join him. It stands to reason he's more than ready for you. Whatever happened to caution Dorn, let us continue on where we'll meet Simeon soon enough. Peter Rex, try to keep up. Oh. Speak and be gone. Try to keep up. I stand with ease. All right, and I always am. You butt kicking for goodness. Hmm? With ease. Okay. So we go where? Inside the entrance of Baldur's Gate. With Outside ease. the entrance. Okay. Can we not exit this? Of course we can. Okay, I thought we could explore this. Must be here. Ah. I can almost feel his presence. My patron hums with excitement about this soul. It pulses with energy. Come, we stand at the threshold. After all of this is done, I want to know more about this patron. When course. Simeon's broken body lies at my feet, perhaps I shall reward you with the rest of my tale. But not yet. Not a problem. Walking alone in the Coastway Road. How smart is this? Uh, oh no, it's not you. No, I don't even want quail in my book. Oh fuck. <laughs> hmm? I don't want you. Not a problem. Back. I can almost feel his when Simeon's broken body lies at my feet. Perhaps I shall reward you with the rest of my tale. But not yet. Nope. I knew this day would come, Dorn. I'm grateful that you wasted time killing the others before reaching me. You will find me better prepared to face your revenge. At least you know you deserve my revenge. The others pointed to you, hoping I would show them mercy. Will you also beg? There is no need. Unlike the others, I know just what a blackguard I face. The diviners cost me the king's ransom. Or black but they God. showed me the path you followed to gain your powers. Now I have followed it as well. Knowing the source of my powers does you no good, Brigand. Urgothors will feed upon your soul. Perhaps, Dorn. But your demon is but one of many. And I am not without a patron of my own. The enemies. Behold, Dorn. We are both bombs, but only one of us shall be captured. <laughs> Shield. Cut it, 
guys Oh, they're not reacting because I didn't have the AI on. Ooh, what is this? Elven Chainmail. Blackguard. 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 Feasts on the souls of my voyage. My revenge is complete. Yet you blackguard, and you say blackguard. Yet you blackguard me when I talk. Yeah, but. Okay, okay, but it's his class also, Blackguard, no? Blackguard, at least a <laughs> nice dead, it's patron block. You got those feats on the, on the souls of my betrayers, my revenge is complete. What happened to Simeon before the battle? Looked like his, if he had powers like yours, what will you do now? Your quest is over. Now you can cast off the evil that has taken all of you. I know little more. And that Urgothar's demands blood. An easy price for me to pay while pursuing my vendetta. Your path has been even bloodier. Perhaps I should continue to follow it at your side. Yes, even as I say so, I sense Urgothar's wounds. Will you no. keep me by your side? I guess. Good. Let us leave this place. I have much Whatever to consider about my I wish my ear. I need to poison the bastard sword plus one plus two damage. This is nice. Ooh, wow. Can I use this? I actually can. Right? I fucked that. <sighs> this is... No, not this is not better. Plus 50. This still gives me minuses. Spellcasting is not disabled, but uh, mages cannot use it. Okay. Okay, I think we're gonna give it to him, because he only has this. I think this is better. No, it's not even close to being better. No one can use this efficiently. Oh well. And this is also not useful. This is kind of neat. Plus two versus spells. Spells, spells. Uh, six. Eleven. Wow, that's nice. Wow. Your shit. It's actually pretty poor on my part. I might remove this and put that on. I have my 
minus two there. So I cannot put on any of these. No, no, I can't. Because of this, right? Yes, not a problem. That call. I stand ready. It will be done. Okay, next, the monk. It will be done. Never had rats, no sorry. No, that's not what I want. Uh, who had it? Oh, I need to drop Dorn at the friendly arms. In there. No, it's not better than this. This is a 1, minus 2, minus 2. 2, minus 1. Okay. Do you worry? It is a mistake to bring others on your mission. Someone could betray you. Anyone who crosses me dies. Do I have to start worrying about you? Is there someone you suspect? Since you ask. By the full armor, I mislike your insin insinuation at all. A fine warrior. But she serves her god before she serves you. Careful what you say, af -orc. He has already proven himself weak for love. What is that, though? Someone questions our loyalty? He is a mighty warrior, but he loves that gerbil above all else. He's loyal evil, right? You dare to call Boo a gerbil? Take back your ma much malignant accusation as the mighty boots of justice leap and bound across the territory of your backside. I do not threaten your hamster. Trust you are not disparaging my loyalty, Blackguard. The witch around of sh Russian men do not forget such I insult. distrust her witch's ways and phony shows of virtue. So you see, even those you hold close cannot be trusted. That's a bleak outlook. You were suspicious of everyone even before Simeon, weren't you? I was not suspicious enough of Simeon's gang. They masked their hatred for my half-orc heritage, fooling me into thinking they were my friend. Never again. Will I delude myself in such I am a your manner? Friend. We don't need to be friends. We don't need to trust each other. Hmm. Perhaps the strong may trust the strong, but it remains what to be are proved. They? No, she's lawful. She's lawful good? Chaotic good, neutral good, true neutral, neutral evil. Chaotic good. For a neutral evil guy, he seems to be very focused be on done. trust and, and loyalty and such. Not a problem with ease. Yeah, I need to drop Dorn, not here, but at the friendly arms end. And let's take a pause here. With ease. I won't actually have to equip the monk. Maybe a little bit. Hmm? Not a problem. Be direct. It shall be even bloodier than you hoped. Uh, did I read it? Please don't let this little alarm you. I intend to know I'm in fact I'm really so that I didn't read it. Because as soon as I picked it up, he kind of interrupted. You should know our old friend Dorn and escaped his cell in Wisconsin. They used to track it down several members of our old group. I don't doubt their names are cutting quickly with the those murders. Especially, I have made powerful allies since I last saw you. My men and I were in hidden camp to the outside the entrance. Okay. Let's 
horses are nice. Yes, not a problem. <laughs> I don't think I need this. Oops. Hello. Piercing. Hmm. Oh. Okay, I don't know what to do with that. Whatever they need, no less than done. Do you want? By Tempush is a fine day to die. Everybody has a belt. Oh, no, not everybody. And because it shall be even bloodier than you hoped. No, no, no. It's actually some good stuff. I stand with ease. Problem. Oh no, why did I leave him in front of Oh but Nira wasn't there anymore? Not a problem. Did she come back here? They might come back here after a while, so maybe I just I should just drop him anywhere. Let's see. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Gather your party before venturing forth. Please, seek With yourself ease. whatever you wish. Uh, okay, I Mister. will listen for now. You go. Peter Rack, you wish me to leave? Yes. Hmm. You shouldn't make a habit of committing mistakes like this. They add up. If you change your mind, I shall be at the friendly army in. This group shows hmm? not a problem. <laughs> we got back their reputation. With ease. So apparently on the east of this I am proud to stand among such strong warriors. There would be that guy. That was a noble deed. And that other um, NPC. I don't want to get him right now, I just want to see if he's really there. He said I'll oh, bet, yeah, that's right there, boom. Okay, that's another NPC, so we'll do him last, since we got him last.
Not a problem. Uh, what's his name? Razan. Razan. See? Such feats are easy when you learn to focus their energies through the light of Selune. What are you doing here? Thank you for asking. My name is Rasat. I am merely demonstrating some of the ways in which we Sun Soul monks reflect our spiritual light through physical activity. May I tell you more about the Order of the Sun Soul? Please do, look if you're just asking for money. The Order of the Sun Soul was founded during the time of... Hey! What are you supposed to be then? Some sort of kick puncher? Come on! Take a poke at me! I dare you! I have come not to fight, but to demonstrate a few... Oh, so that's how it is, eh? You prance about, pretending to be some sort of hard man, but you're just a coward, right? I am not afraid to defend myself, but I do not seek out conflict without purpose. Instead, I wish to share the light of the Moon Maiden. Oh, I get it. You're some kind of simpering priest, just pretending you knows how to fight, but really just begging for coins, yeah? A Sun Soul monk uses mind, body and spirit in equal portions, but not to prove his martial superiority. Rather, he seeks to better the lives of those around him. Yeah, yeah, save it for temple school, boy. If you're not gonna fight nobody, I won't waste any more time on you. I thank you. It is not always easy. In truth, I enjoy a good fight if it is to improve my skills or to defend a just cause. Fighting that man would have enlightened no one. You seem like someone who would appreciate the tenets of my order. May I tell you more about Salune and the Sun Soul monks? Of the inheritors of Amonitor's power, Salune is the most ardent foe of spiritual darkness. After all, she is the bright opposite of Shah, the mistress of the night. The Moon Maiden's reflected radiance inspires us to shine our inner light upon those in need. In the face of lies, we offer truth. In the face of hatred, we offer compassion. What more would you like to know? The Order of the Sun Soul was founded in the days of ancient Netherim. Then it was called the Brotherhood of the Sun, and its members dedicated themselves to the Sun God, Amonitor. With the fall of Netherim, Amonitor vanished. Some believe his power now resides in other gods. Different factions of my order turn to them, most to Lathander, some to Selune, and a very few to Sunu. My sect of the order reveres Sulune, the Moon Maiden. What more would you like to know? I have had trouble making ends meet since coming to Nashkel. If doing so gives me the chance to help others find their inner light, I will be glad to join you. This one also fights with weapons. You must teach him some of these special moves. Your wish? Okay, so we'll use this cattle now. Okay. Sling. Uh, and traps. <laughs> I already find traps, so I don't need them to do that. Okay. What is this? Oh wow. Is it the only one who can use it? Yes, okay. Is there some equipment I can put on him? Maybe. Maybe this. I think I'm gonna leave it, leave him in, uh, in the back. Yes, it will be done. Okay, let's see if you have a quest, mister. I 
going there takes a while. You have been way late. Not a problem. Must defend yourself. You have been way late. Not a problem. You appear troubled. Does a shadow lie upon your soul? I want to know more about you. How did you become a sun soul monk? Monk. It seems so long ago that I first joined the order. Thinking of those days revives fond memories. Even as it reminds me of those precious things, I... my mother gave up her own life to give life to me. Without her help, my father struggled to raise me and my older brother Gamaz. Life in Kalimport is hard for those not born to wealth and privilege. When he could no longer pay his rising debts, my father was condemned to the arena of freedom, where he fought and died for the entertainment of the people. His death left Gamaz and me to scratch out a life upon the streets. We helped each other as best we could. Begging, serving, and yes, sometimes stealing. One day, Gamaz was caught with his hand upon the purse of a sun soul monk. Rather than punish us, the monk brought us to the monastery, where we were bathed, fed, and clothed as initiates. From that day forward, we learned the mysteries of Selune and trained our bodies, minds, and spirits to spread her light to others. Your childhood son sounds sad by itself, like things are not all right. Why didn't you say so earlier? You think of the money I could have saved on torches. Indeed. Selune blessed Gamaz and me the day we met that monk. From that day forward, the light of the goddess brightened our existence. How may I enlighten you? Well, divided by distance and allegiance to three different gods, the various sects of the Order of the Sun Soul cooperate across Faroon. When the sect Nath Katla ceased responding to messages, my masters in Kalimport sent ten monks to investigate. Gamaz and I were among those chosen to set sail for Arm. We found the monastery abandoned. The nearby residents we questioned about the mystery changed the subject or fled. For weeks, we continued to investigate. At last, through stealth, subterfuge, and patience, we began to overhear rumors that agents of Shah, the mistress of the night, had murdered all the Sun Soul monks in Athkatla. The local residents feared Shah too much to speak with us. But again and again, we overheard one name uttered in fearful whispers. Alogoth. Who is this Alogoth? Who he is, what he did to the monks in Athkatla, or where he has gone, I cannot say. The trail is lost, unless I stumble across the name Alogoth again one day. How may I enlighten you? It will be done. You have been waylaid it by will enemies. Be done. Gather your party before ah. things What is your thy Valkor's mighty blade? Hmm? With ease. Yeah, um, yeah, going here is not a good idea. You have been waylaid not by enemies and must defend yourself. You have been waylaid not by enemies problem. and must defend yourself. Go for the eyes! Go for the eyes! Go for the eyes! Your wit salute, guys, my hands. For right! Go for the eyes! Go for the eyes! I stand ready with ease. Traps here. No. Hmm? It will be done. You have been waylaid by with enemies ease. and must defend yourself. <coughs> with ease. You have been waylaid by Not enemies a and must defend yourself. It will be will done. You seek enlightenment. I'd like to know more about your search for the missing Sun Soul Mold and all that your training in your search. After discovering our fellow Sun Soul monks had vanished from their monastery, we felt the truth must lie behind the name Alagoth. We spread out in pairs to investigate further. Gamaz and I, used to life on Kalimport streets, searched for rumors on the streets of Atkatla. Much of our investigation took place at night, under the benign gaze of Selune. You see, 
Although the sun shines more brightly, it is the moon that reveals the truths hidden in darkness. One night, we witnessed several shadowy figures assaulting a lone man on the street. We raced to his defense. The moon maiden blessed us, and we drove off his attackers. Despite our intervention, the man was gravely wounded. I remained with him, tending his wounds as best I could while calling for help. Gamaz, however, pursued the attackers. I shouted to him to come back, but he did not listen. Sometimes I wonder whether things would have been different if I had followed Gamaz instead of remaining with the wounded man. I suppose it might have been worse had I gone with him. Still, I wish that night I could have been two men. One to remain with the injured man, another to go with my brother. When help finally arrived, I ran after Gamaz. I found him only a few streets away. My brother had fought bravely, slaying three of his attackers before he was brought down. Once more, I cried out for help. Men came soon, but not to aid me. Instead, they arrested me for fighting in the streets, leaving Gamaz to die in a pool of his own blood. When the guards released me the following day, Gamaz had died. They said he had been slain by shadow thieves. The guards could not even give me his body, for they had burned it with those of the other dead men. It's terrible. I'm sorry for your loss. It's a shame that at least you survived for everything. Disheartened by the tragedy, my fellow monks returned to Kalimpur. Gamaz and I had entered the monastery together as brothers. I could not return without him. Neither could I remain in Atkatla, a city that forever holds evil memories for me. I traveled north. <coughs> At first I thought I might visit the Monastery of the Sun in Waterdeep, which they called the City of Splendors. Yet I was in no hurry to arrive. Every day since entering the Order of the Sun's Soul, I had striven to fill my heart with radiance that I may share it with others. After Gamaz's death, I felt only the shadows of grief and despair. But perhaps I have dwelt too long on such memories. I wish to share my inner light with you, not my inner dark. What else can I tell you? My training at the Sun Soul Monastery began the moment the kindly monk brought Gamaz and me inside its walls. As you might imagine, there was a great deal of physical training. At first, we were assigned chores and exercises. We looked with envy upon the older initiates who practiced combat techniques while we swept the stones and prepared meals for our seniors. The monks taught us to read and write, and why it is important to do both with careful thought. We practiced debate, studied history, and answered endless quizzes about the 9,000 mysteries of Salune. We learned to meditate upon the moon, the shards, and the stars. We also learned to meditate on the darkness between them, for it falls to us to battle the servants of Salune's dark sister, Shar. At last we learned to combine our learning, devotion, and physical prowess to project our inner light outward. With it, we combat the darkness inside or surrounding others. We all strove hard, but Gamaz was the best among us. None of the other monks could defeat him in combat. Only I could come close. But each time victory was within my grasp, he swept it away with some spectacular... Even among the elder students, Gamaz stood as a pillar of tradition and excellence. His death was a great loss. Not only to me as his brother, but also to the entire order of the Sun Soul. <laughs> now that's a story you should use when begging. I almost wanted to give you money right now just to make you stop telling it. I thought it best that you should know my past, since what else can I tell you? After discovering it, I shouted to him to come back, but he did not listen. I suppose it might have been once when the guards released me the following day. Thank this heart, neither yet I was in no hurry to. But what else can I tell you? At, the, we, at last we learned to combine our. It seemed that even among the elder students, the Mars. What else can I tell you? Okay. Yes. We need to talk to him again. Not a problem. You have been waylaid by oh, enemies and must... You have been waylaid it by enemies and must defend yourself. My training did not prepare me for such extended activity. Ooh, I'm tired. Not a problem.
with ease. You I am proud to stand among such strong tempests. Give us victory! It is time for us to rest. You have been waylaid by enemies and must defend yourself. It will be done. Come on. Is that it? You have been waylaid by it enemies. It will be done. You have been waylaid With by ease. enemies and must defend yourself. You have been waylaid by With enemies ease. and must defend yourself. Make him. With ease. Huh. Okay, one last time. I mean, I'll look up if there is you something. You have been waylaid. Oh my god. Look at that shit. That's a lot of words. So if you don't know, I'm trying to trigger the side mission here. Maybe there's none. That would be surprising, but maybe it's just all he's saying to me. I don't know. Rasa. Oh, we need to travel to Salt Baldur's Gate at night. That's it. There's nothing else. This? Not a problem. It wasn't even night. There is. Just as Sorum described. A slave of the hated one. Our mistress shall be pleased, and Sorum shall have his role. Slay the Sun Soul and those who stand with him. Be careful, friend. Some of these people are the same who attacked the Mars and me in her cat lab. <laughs> we are in bad shape right now. My training did not prepare me to such extent. The sinuous manner in which they dodged. Those who attacked the Moz and me in Athkatla were not shadow thieves. They were Dark Moon monks. They must have tracked me here. What do you want? What do you want? What do they want with you? One of the cult's principal goals is the eradication of the Sun Soul monks and all worshippers of Salude. They will not rest until their dark purposes eclipse our efforts. We must stop them. We must prepare ourselves for another attack when we least expect it. The Dark Moon watch. Wait and strike from the shadows. They said someone named Sora directed them to me. When I spent some time in Baldur's Gate, a man named Sora used to come to my demonstrations of martial skill. I sometimes saw him returning to the Blade and Stars Tavern. I must rest. An agent of the most hated goddess has been observed within the Baldur's Gate. Within Baldur's Gate, it appears that he is alone, so killing him will be easy. In the Blade and Star's Tavern, speak to a prospective acolyte named Sorum. He will guide you with a description of your target. Seek out and stay and slay this target of Saloon, and bring his body to the shrine. I will brook no failure, no the mistress of the night. Yes, that's not a problem. I will require rest soon. Um, it will be done. It will be done. I don't remember where it is.
It will be done. Wait, wait, wait. It will be done. My Let's rooms sleep are best kept on the sword too. There you go. Mate. To define your future, you must know your past, Wanderer. Okay. Something you require? Aliandra sees through the mist of the lady and that you are strong and worthy adventurers. Aliandra, what happened to Shayla? I searched every inch of candle key and can't find the great book of the knowing. Oh, yay! <laughs> yeah, we have to continue asking questions. Walk well in the mist. No. Something you require? Oh. Guess that was not good. It will be done. Something you require? Well, now it's done. Okay. My rooms are the best kept on the Sword Coast. Picking your nose. Yeah, mate. Who do we have to talk to? You are a valuable companion. It will be done. Who do you think you are, busting in on me like this? We know you sent your Dark Moon allies after us. Special delivery for one dirty rotten Dark Moon snitch? That would be you. I'm going to spill your guts metaphorically or literally. Your choice. If it were me, I'd start talking about the Dark Moon. Dark Moon? I don't know what you're talking about. Rasad, would you care to do the honors? While I abhor unnecessary violence, perhaps I can make an exception in this case. Exception for butt kicking. Boo! Boo likes his baldy monk better and better. All right, all right. No need to get rough with me. I'm not the one you want. As it turns out, I do have a line on a group of Shah worshippers in the city. You leave me alone. I'll tell you where to find it. You're in no position to gamble, to negotiate. I'm starting to think you're no. You're no more useful alive than dead. What do you know? There's a cult that calls itself the Dark Moon. They've been in Baldur's Gate for less than a year, but they're always looking for new recruits. They're pretty rough characters, so yeah, when they asked me about your buddy Rasad, I told them what I knew. A while back, I saw him in Nashville. Then I spotted him again here in Baldur's Gate. They have a safe house over in the Seven Sons building. I can show you the way if you meet me there tonight. What do you want? They worship Shah, the mistress of the night. When else do you think they get together? Terrific. I'll meet you there. All right. Here's the place, just like I promised. Since you've been so good about not killing me, I brought you a present. The key to this building. Hmm? What the fuck is this building? What is? In fact, Tonight's all about more bringing presents from our best pals. Hey, boys. You were those friends I told you about. Come on out and say hello. You have done well, Sorum. Your admission to the Order is now assured. I suppose I'll have this one to thank. Be sure to give him some special gratitude. I thought I was in when I found your son's old pal, but you screwed it up. Consider this your way of making it up to me. They're called as directed. Yes. Go. Whatever is directed. I stand for steel. I stand ready. They wish my ear. Go for the eyes. Go for the eyes. Ah! 
Nothing on them. So what is this building? Have we been to this building? Let's start. Sorum, your acceptance in the Dark Moon Brotherhood depends entirely on whether you succeed in luring the Sun Soul Monk into our trap. Bring his broken body to the new temple on Cloud Peak Mountain to claim your reward. Welcome to the Dark Embers of the Mystery of the Mind. They are training you. I stand ready. Let us journey to these cloud peaks and face the Dark Moon cult. Alone, I could never defeat them. But together, we have a chance to put an end to their murderous campaign. While I will never forget Gamoz's death, my desire is not for revenge. I wish only to stop the Dark Moon from claiming more victims. What do you say, my friend? Shall we pursue these assassins to their den? We shall. Their evil will not eclipse their land while I am here to stop it. What's in for us, Rasad? You know what they say. If you do something well, don't do it for free. <laughs> Maybe they'll say we welcome someone. Yeah. Your words give me courage, my friend. I thank you. Okay. Hmm? It will be done. Uh, I don't think these things are. Whatever they need. They wish my ear. Yes, not a problem. With ease. Is that a new spot? It is. Oh, interesting. A new With place ease. to discover. Legit. This? Or it's on the right. Or it's here. It might be here. It makes sense. Nope, this works. I 
I stand ready. Not a problem. What time is it? 16 hour. I want to be the I will show you justice. The worthy. Oh, no. I don't want to do this. It will be day eight. Excellent. Oh, this is new music, right? Sounds new. Anyway, I'll take a break and we'll be back in a couple of minutes. Stay tuned. Robin Hood, your bow is needed. Outwit and outfight your deadliest enemies as Robin Hood, boldest outlaw in all England. A curse upon you and all the outlaws of Sherwood Forest. For every insult to my person, you'll pay tenfold. Fall under the spell of the beautiful and mysterious Marion.
conspiracy, love, powerful enemies, boisterous adventure, and constant danger await you in Conquests of the Longbow. Are you ready to be Robin Hood? There's no time to rest when your foe doesn't sleep. System Shock by Origin successfully weaves adventure and action to create a novel science fiction challenge. Marvel at the first person 3D smooth scrolling viewpoint as you jump, lean around corners, look up and down, crawl, and even fly in rocket boots. Experience the most sophisticated physics system in a computer game, complete with variable gravity, recoil, and explosions. Listen to the new dynamically layered music system while viewing realistic illumination effects. Please. The worthy, who have already begun their training in the temple above. And then there are you worthless wretches, the feeble, infirm, foolish, and disobedient. Mercy, master! We came only to serve Shah! Silence, worm! You could not even cross the Nightingale floor without waking the guard. The mistress of the night has weighed your shadow and deemed you unworthy. It isn't fair! The trials were too hard! So says the most craven of the applicants. You lack the courage even to attempt escape like the others. Your cowardice sickens me. They shall not remain free for long. After we have dispensed with you, we will scour the peaks. They will wish the Oh man, come on, come on, are first. you kidding me, Rez? <laughs> <laughs> she was right here. Oh, she was right here. She was here the whole time. She just went away. Ah, man. Where is she? I know, I know. <laughs> there you go, she's right there. Like, now she's more sick of me. Now she's like, ah, what do you want? What do you want? I don't get it. I don't get it. Mm. 
It was free earlier. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> She's too fluffy. She's too fluffy. Look at that. That's, what, that's a lot of fucking air. <laughs> Whoa, the wire, the wires, okay. Like a wild bear, she's so big and poofy, exactly. Yeah. You're sending her mixed messages, exactly. She doesn't get what's going on. Doesn't give a shit. Anyway, they shall now remain free for long after we have dis dispensed with you. We'll scour the peaks. They will wish the ice trolls had found them first. See how the servants of Shah treat their acolytes? She's they actually even on super own. happy then. She, she's really grateful for those, those 35,000 channel points. Yeah, no, she's really... She's in love with me, clearly. She thinks I'm a cat. <laughs> I'm not a cat. No. Nope. Mm hmm? Nope. Not a cat. See how the servants of Shar treat their acolytes. Oh, he, he did say Look, that. Look, my brothers. Intruders. I don't have to read Slay them. Slay them in the name of Shah. No, not that much. Like, a little bit, but uh, uh, compared to what you, you would think, no. She has a lot of fur, but it doesn't like even when I have like her, her brush, and I'm like, <laughs> and then I look at the brush and there's nothing, and she's got, yeah, she she has her, she's got her, um, her caress for the day. Yes, it will be done. Smooth out of the way. They're called. Whatever they need. Rather we just Come on. I stand ready with ease. Yes. Your wish? They wish my ear. Can you take that? Mm, that's not better than what he has. Hmm? Yes? I stand. It will be done. You have to kill them with fire, like in Icewind Dale? Was it in Icewind Dale that we needed to fire them? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was really cool. Yeah. Uh, usually, like, the, that's, that does it. With ease. That might be annoying with, uh, with only her. That can use fire. Well, oh no, I have a bunch of fire arrows. Yeah, and the game gives me a lot of them. And I yes. Stand ready. 
Maybe I should stay on them at this point. Hmm? Not a problem. It will be done. I look they forward to your instruction. wish my directed. I stand ready. Hmm? Not a problem. like two arrows and two arrows and guys. Can we enter this? No. Yes? That comes. I stand not a problem. Fog of war here is different than other maps, right? These maps just feel different. And I think they just didn't use uh, the same. I am proud to stand up such a strong warrior. It doesn't show here because it's just white snow. But uh, in that other map here, it even felt like it was uh, lower resolution here, or it was like more filtered. Yeah, but this is weird. This is more 3D than. Uh... Yeah, I just noticed it, but I don't know. I will you show you Chakos cheap. No, 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 I will show you Victory! Tempest, give us victory! Selune guides my hand. I stand ready. Hmm? I oh, prepared. since I put AI. Prefer range. Even if he's a monk. Yes. <laughs> I stand with his ease. AC is so low.
these missions, the NPC missions, are kind of long and not that interesting. Go for the eyes! Go for the eyes! Go for the eyes! Rask! Like when you create just one big area here for one mission. Like Baldur's Gate doesn't do that. Oh, I think there's many classes I haven't played, especially if you go in like the special classes. I don't I never played the fighter. Well maybe I did in one like little short games for fun, but not really seriously. The trials have eliminated the weak and the foolish. The clumsy and the craven. The winnowing leaves only you. The worthiest applicants for Shah's dark favor. Today, you enter her umbra, bearing not just your body and mind, but also your soul to the mistress of the night. As you train in the darkest mysteries, you too will hear the whispers of the goddess. Believe me, her words bring no comfort. Shah does not coddle the infirm or insubordinate. But to the worthy who obeys, she grants strength and power. Far more power than that wielded by our hated foes, the servants of the moon. What? Who dares intrude on our sanctuary? Can it be? My name is Camilio and I have come to prevent your reign of terror. Are you talking to me? He is talking to me. Gamaz! My brother! How is it you still live? Rasad? Why have you come here after leaving me to die in the streets of Akatla? I did not wish to leave you, brother. The city guards arrested me. They told me you were dead, slain by the shadow thieves. I see that you have learned to lie, Rasad. Perhaps you too are ready to hear the whispers of Shar. I will share them with you, just as Alargoth shared them with me. I've heard that name before. <laughs> Alargoth found me on that street where you left me, Rasad. Rather than leave me to die, he took me into his shadow, but not to coddle me. Instead, he showed me the cold hard truth of our existence. He showed me how I had grown weak under the tutelage of the Sun Soul monks. He showed me how my own brother had made me weaker still. Only power stands between us and destruction. Had I been strong enough to destroy my foes, I would have needed no help. Now the Shadow Weave grants me the strength my body lacked. In the Umbra of Shar, I stand alone with no need of help from others. Standing as standing beside ally, there's no sign of weakness. It takes strength to become an ally. You have been misled, Gamaz. There is no truth in Shah, only lies. What this Alogoth calls power is only a trap to turn you away from the light. Do not turn away from me, Gamaz. You cannot kill me. I am your brother. <laughs> Pretty sure that can is kill true. you. I cannot kill my brother. Why don't we just test that theory? That's good. If taking the first step away from the lies of Shar. Applicants, kill my brother. Oh. <laughs> hmm? and no Whatever they need. Yes, not a problem. I will go I will show you just give us victory. Not a problem. Forgive me, my friend. I thought my brother did, and never imagined he had joined the Dark Moon cult. So it was definitely your brother, not someone in disguise. Do I have to start worrying about you? If one brother turned to the dark moon, how can I trust the other? 
If I join the Dark Moon, maybe. And if you join the Dark Moon, you become more powerful than you are now. Not someone in the sky. Let's go with this. That was definitely Gamas. There can be. I cannot imagine what force persuaded Gamas to turn his back on the light of Salune and embrace the void of Shah. Maybe he resented. Me. Resented me? What reason could he have for such feelings? Perhaps, Selune, shine your light upon this humble fool. Is it possible I have driven my own brother into the embrace of the Dark Moon? I <laughs> knew you were Dark Moon infiltrated the whole time. Selune, shine your light upon this humble fool. Is it possible I have driven my own brother into the embrace of the Dark Moon? Why do I say, wait a second, what are you talking about? A saloon, the... So that's what you were talking about, with the goddess of the Night Mother? Talking about? Even when we lived in the gutters of Kalimport and stole bread to survive, Gamaz was my hero. When he tried to steal that monk's purse and was caught, I thought he had caused a miracle allowing us to live in the monastery. Once we began training with the monks, okay. I saw how disappointed Gamaz looked whenever another student exceeded him at an exercise. But Gamaz was very quick to learn. Soon no one could exceed him. Except... We were always closely matched. Winning mattered little to me, but to Gamaz it meant everything. Whenever the Temple Masters pitted us against each other, I did my best. Up to a point. And then you let Gamas win. I am to blame for my brother's yearning for greater power. Maybe it's a mistake if I turn you in. It's not your fault. Thank you for putting my failure in such a kind light, my friend. Blah. I shall endeavor to learn from my mistake. Mm, darn, that's not done. Why is not done? Okay, I don't understand why it's not done. Hmm? With ease. Okay, there might be more stuff to do here. Not a problem. Dorn, it felt done when it was. I'll show you time. Uh, let's change arrows. Uh, go for the eyes, boo. Go for the eyes. Not a problem. I stand with ease. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hmm? With ease. I will show you justice. Go for the eyes, boo. Go I will show you justice. I will show you justice. I stand ready. It will be done. Hmm? It will be done. It will be done. I stand ready. Not a problem. Hmm? With ease. Yes, 
Not a problem. I stand ready. Semper, give us victory! I look forward to your instruction. I shall commit to the task. I don't know, don't Your wits illuminate yeah. guides my hand. <laughs> Stop that. Hmm? With ease. the traps there's a guy right there okay yes sacrilege these dark wound worshippers have desecrated the four armors temple let us sweep these shadow ringing wretches from the mountain in the name of tempest come on listen to me Shah has seduced you with lies. The power she offers is only the power of destruction. You know this to be true. It was the Sun Soul monks who lied to us. But Alargar opened my eyes to the truth that lies in darkness. Now that I have opened myself to the Shadow Weave, my powers have grown far beyond those we learned in Kalimport. How have you forgotten all of our lessons? Dark sorcery can only destroy, not preserve. The promises of Shah are as empty as the void of her heart. All promises are empty, Rasad, and Shah offers none. She only demands our obedience. In return, she grants us the power to exert her will throughout the land. You do not need such power, Kamaz. In the Order of the Sun Soul, you were always the strongest among us. You lie again. Do you really believe I never noticed how you held back when sparring against me. Say it now, before your new friends. Deny that you pretended to lose to me in every contest. I... I... Tell the truth. I cannot lie to you, Gamas. During our training, sometimes I did withhold my full strength. Winning always seemed more important to you than it felt to me. Somehow, I always knew. Only now would I have freed myself from the bonds of light. Can you finally speak the truth to me? But now, it is too late. Unless, strike down your new companions and bow before me. Prove yourself worthy, and I shall admit you into the shadow. <laughs> Don't even think about it, I'm much more dangerous. Go ahead. Don't listen to him. I have no desire for power that serves only its <laughs> weak. switch now. I reject the lies of Shah Oh, you're really stupid. I beg you to do the same. I embrace the night and all the power Shah offers. Destroy them, minions. Go for the eyes, fool! Go for the eyes! Ask! Show you just... 
shall commit to the task. I stand ready. It will be done. Hmm? It will be done. Stand ready. gains from it. Why? 1812, 1893, 18, 19 would be good. I, with ease. Who gives a shit about intelligence? Let's talk him, more fight! No, 1893 is really good. Maybe him. 19. Intelligence 10 is going to be dropping at 9? Are you kidding me? No, 6. Hmm. Hmm? I do think it's a win. Hey, Michael Thing! Yes? How's it going? Not a problem. Because I am doing pretty good. Game is glitching out on me. See those cages? They appear to have been opened recently. These cages were used to house combat beasts and monsters. Thus, the clerics of the phone hammer. Is that normal? I want to restart the game. Well, oh, okay. See those cages? They appear to have been opened. Not a recently. problem. That's normal sound. <laughs> uh, no, no, you can't. No, that's just uh, the picture that uh, I do play an L. So in my mind, he's a draw. You know, <laughs> it's all about role play. <laughs> I will show you justice. They did add a couple of things, uh, mostly classes. Hmm? It will be done. 
Ice with ease. Hmm? It will be done. All right. With ease. All I right. will show you justice. Always Go for the eyes, Boo. Go for the eyes. Rask! Go for the eyes, Boo. Go for the eyes. Rask! One of these riddle cages sets off a deadly trap. If you open the wrong cage, we'll all die horribly. Hmm. Don't answer. You know the rules. The moment either of us answers a question, the cage blasts everyone. <laughs> no one has had the courage to open a cage yet. Yeah, if you open the right one first, you can free us both. I, for one, would be very grateful if you did. After we tell you these rules, the magic of the cages lets us know which one is trapped. But it also forces one of us to lie, and the other to tell the truth. Oh, <laughs> really? Oh, really? We're gonna do this now? Holy shit! The hard part is that you, you can ask. What originality? The really hard part is that we don't know which of us must lie or tell the truth until the riddle begins. Yeah, yeah, I understand the riddle. And after one of us, I played this when I was young. I just don't understand. I, I don't remember. Uh, what was the right uh, thing you need to do? This will be easy, I don't know, this sounds hard. Let's see what's the right question to ask. Uh, oh, I can even save right now. Because I have the power of reloading. This riddle is pointless. <laughs> can I talk to you? Ask okay. me the right question and free us both. Is your ca cage the one that's trapped? Is the other cage the one that's trapped? Which cage will the other prisoner tell me is safe to open? Yeah, that's kind of a good question. If I ask the other prisoner, will he tell me the truth? Which of these cages is not trapped? 50-50, <laughs> just do it. Uh, let's try to resume logically do this uh, if I say if I ask the prisoner will he tell me that I, I might need some kind of pencil or some note here Do I have something to write no <laughs> I do have my phone. I want to out time out of this game, it's so annoying. Okay, so if I ask the other prisoner, will he tell me the truth? So if he's the truth sayer, he can't say uh, that guy will tell me the truth. Will tell the truth, because he's the truth sayer, so he's gonna say that guy will will tell a lie. If he's the liar, was he did he ob was he obligated to lie? I think so. That's how the real works. So if he's the liar and I ask him If I ask the other prisoner, will he tell me the truth? If he's the liar, he's gonna say yes. So he says yes in both cases. Oh, no, no. No, no, if he's the liar, he's gonna say no. <laughs> yeah, if he's the liar, he's gonna say... Because the other guy is telling the truth, if he's a liar. So that doesn't help me. Which cave will the other prisoner tell me is safe to open? 
Which cage will the other prisoner tell me is safe to open? Wait, the solution is to kill them both? Getting involved in this fucker. <laughs> which case... Which cage will the other prisoner tell me is safe to open? If he's the truth sayer... He's gonna say... Well, I don't know. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't know about that. I don't know which cage is open. Because that thing, I kind of can do some things, but there's too many random things here. Which of these cages is not trapped? Which cage will the other prisoner... This looks like the right one. Which cage will the other prisoner tell me is safe to open? I just say that's right. Oh yes, yes, I saw that. No, it's not. It's not exactly. No, that's not it. Wow, that escalated quickly. <laughs> Twitch cannot fart uh, without like being some kind of uh, people being like, <laughs> Twitch, you farted. No, it's like no, it, Twitch farts and. Everybody's like, fuck, Twitch shit is pants! It's more like that. Which shows the streamer chat behavior if he's friendly or an asshole. No, 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 no. It's not that at all. <laughs> it's not that at all. You get a score, yes, but it's for ads. But yeah, I guess they can use it for other things, but it's to uh, more being able to YouTube has that so everybody has that except Twitch so this is not new <laughs> Twitch implements something in his algorithm or or whatever and people are like what? it's automatically it must be if Twitch is doing it it must be bad right anyways because right now when you're watching my streams you're saying you you're seeing the same type of ads as you would be watching any other stream. So I'm sure that eventually you'll get ads. I'm sure on my stream you will get ads that are, I think, more mature. You'll get ads that are surely for men. <laughs> you'll have ads to shave your balls and the stuff like that. You'll get maybe shudder, uh, shudder uh, ads and things like that. To be frank, if you shout that Twitch chat, it's banned on a random day, it's pretty much 50 50 if it's true or not. I swear that Twitch will begin killing streamers first born at midnight on March 15. Ah. <laughs> okay, let's try stuff. The other cage. Okay. Can I ask the same question to the other one? I guess so, right? Oh no. That didn't help, help us at all. Hey, DRS. Thanks for the hosts. Ask me the right question and free us both. This one, right? If I ask the other question, will it tell the truth? No. No. Yeah, that's what I deduce that everybody will say no, right? Done. Ask me the right question and free us both. No. Exactly, both say that, so that doesn't help me at all. Not a problem. Ask me the right question. Which of these cages is not trapped? My cage. Oh, 
अब यू कर दे It will be done. Thank you. Now kill that Dark Moon spy before he kills one of us. Now there's no telling where he'll pop out from the shadows. My name is. I saw that. I must go tell him by the full hammer. We shall have our revenge against these Dark Moon monks. Assuming you leave any alive, with ease. Good luck to you, friend. I still don't Ask understand. Ask me the right question and free us both. Is your cage a trap? Yes. Yes. I need to save here. Let's save. With ease. Ask me the right question. Yes. It will be done. Ask me the right question. Which cage will the other person tell me a safe to open? No. Yeah, of course, both we'll say that. It will be done. Ask me the right question and free us both. My cage. Both we'll say my cage here, but I, I'll, I need to talk to both to, to know that. I have no idea how to. Uh, it will be done. Ask if I would right be able to ask both the same question, both. that's another, but now I'm missing some element here. Because they always say the same thing. Both of them say the same thing because you have one liar and one... Yes. Yes. Look, I'm going to prove it to you. It will be Yes. Done. Ask me the right question. Yes. Yes. It will be done. Ask me the right... No. No. It will be done. Ask me the right question. No. No. Not a problem. Ask me the right question. The other cage. The other cage. Not a problem. Ask me the right question. My cage. Exactly. They always say the same thing. So it doesn't help me. I don't get how you can deduce that. We're done. missing one element. Ask me the right question and free us both. No. It will be done. Ask me the right no, question it's not. and free us both. No. It will be done. Ask me the right yes. It will be done. Wait, 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 wait. Ask me the right question and free us both. Oh no, this is different though. Is your cage the one that's trapped? Now they don't tell no, now they don't say the same thing. If I say is your cage the one that's trapped? Yes. He says yes. And if I ask it him will be done. Ask me oh, the no. right yes. Yeah. So he's the one telling the truth. With ease. Ask me the right question and free us both. And by asking me this question, it would... Yes. I would be able to know that? No, there's no way. Did they forget to put some kind of a limit? It's With impossible ease. that they... They fucked this up. And didn't properly introduce this riddle. Even though 99.9... .9, I assure you, 99.9% .9 of players that come here just don't give a shit. Yeah, I want the right question. I think it's the first one. Can you explain it to me? It will be done. Number three. Yeah, that's the one I thought, but... Which cage will the other prison? It's the most complicated one, but even then, I don't understand. I say this. The other cage. He says the other cage. I ask the other guy. It will be done. Oh, he also says the other cage. Ask me the right question and free us both. My cage. No, he says my cage. With ease. Ask me the right question and free Which us Which cage both. will the other prisoner tell me is safe to open? The trick is that you need to do the opposite of what they say. No, because if you do the opposite of the guy that's telling the truth, you'll be fucked. Like, if I do the opposite of him, 
Which cage will the other prisoner tell me is safe to open? My and cage. He says my cage. Oh, which one? The other one. With these. Ask me the right question and free us. Which both. cage will the other prisoner tell me is safe to open? So if I if he's the truth sayer which case would the other prison time is he knows that the other guy is lying so he knows that the other guy will tell me that the one that is safe is his <laughs> Oh fuck it it's too late for this fucking the other cage thing. Just open the thing it will be done I think I understand <laughs> I used to understand this puzzle. It will be done. Yeah, Thank it's you. the same now puzzle in Labyrinth, except, you except she fails it. No chance of that. Now that I'm free from that cage, you'll never see me again. Now there's no telling where he'll pop out from the shadows. N no, I'm sorry. That's not fair. You freed me, and I'm grateful for that. Who are you? My name is Jasper Banff. I served in this place when it was consecrated to Tempest. But my brothers and I heeded the summons to join our god's avatar in Battledale. I saw that the Dark Moon monks slaughtered those we left behind and claimed the temple for their dark goddess. Before I could escape with news of the desecration, they captured me. I must go tell my brethren of the atrocity these Dark Moon monks have committed against us. Unless you need to know something else. My name is Jasper Banff. I served in this place <laughs> when it was consecrated to Tempest. But my brothers and I but... heeded the summons to join our god's avatar in Battledale. Did he say that if I opened the wrong one they both died? My brother and I heeded the summons to join our god's avatar in Battledale. I saw that the Dark Moon monks slaughtered those we left behind and claimed the temple for their dark goddess. Before I could escape with news of the desecration. They captured me. I must go tell my brother uh, this of the is, atrocity uh, I mean. these Dark Moon monks have committed against us. Basano was one of the Dark Moon monks. He said their leader, Gamaz, imprisoned him for some minor infraction. But that ploy didn't fool me. He was a spy who hoped to ferret out my purpose in coming here. I must go tell my brethren of the atrocity. No, nor did I hear anything. But one does not often see or hear these Dark Moon monks. In the shadows, they are silent and invisible. I must go tell my brethren of the atro- By the foe hammer, we shall have our revenge against these dark moon monks. Assuming you leave any alive. So, are you telling you me... It will be done. Uh, that was a noble deed. If I open up this, I would have thought that this was the right one. Mm -hmm. It will be done. No, they both die. So what then? How can you do that? If you have freed the other guy, I can't free the other guy. Hmm? Yes? With ease. Weird. <laughs> Well, he just said that. He just said that if you would free, if you open up the wrong door, we both die. I am proud you to need to open up the right door for both of them to live. Man, the sound in this game is just driving me crazy. Fuck, shit. It's just annoying. That is the worst echo. If, if that's like an echo sound effect that they tried to do, my god, by the gods. This is not over? Man, this is a long ass I am your party for before DC. venturing forth. Kamaz, my beloved brother, do not force me to stop you. Oh, 
<sighs> Beloved brother, when we were boys, you only pretended to look up to me. Since that day, the Sun Monk caught me stealing. You have only looked down on me. No. I knew you did it as much for me as for yourself. I understood that you... You understood nothing. I was the elder. After father's death, it fell to me to be the strong one. But even in that, you mocked me, holding back whenever we competed at the temple. But that was before Alargoth introduced me to the Shadow Weave. The path to darkness is almost the same as the one taught to us as children. No, I do not believe it. You have been deceived, my brother. Turn away from the Umbra's false promises before it is too late. <laughs> Listen to your brother, Gemas. Rasa knows what he's talking about. <laughs> I thought we'd read the two point expressions. Oh my god, so 2020. Well, this was in 2016, I think, but still. 2010, let's say 2010. The shadow of Shah is far more think, potent gonna than the light me. of her pale sister. Now I call upon the power of sorcery, as well as the skills we learned together. Even with these new friends at your side, you cannot hope to defeat me. Minions, slay my bro- No, Gamas. No more hiding behind your minions. If you wish me dead, you must face me yourself. I have no brother. You are alone, Rasad. Alone for these last living moments. <laughs> Minions, deal with these others while I destroy this sun soul fool. I stand ready. Ah! They're calm. Whatever they need. I understand. Uh, I understand. Gather your party before no. entering forth. You must uh, gather your party before venturing forth. So I was able to come here alone. I am prepared. But now to exit, I need all my party. Is hmm? that Yes. Yeah, pretty much. I look forward to your instruction. Your wish? Selune guides my hand. Oh. Yes. Maybe not. I stand ready. Okay, what's going on here? Not a problem. Move, move, move. Okay. Go for the eyes, Go Go for the eyes. Here. Thy temper steals. Potentis. Now he's not even here. I stand ready. Okay, we'll, we'll get him first before killing that thing because there's gonna be a cutscene. Mm -hmm. This is gonna. The game's gonna crash oh, or some fool. shit. Go for the eyes! Yeah, <laughs> I stand ready. <laughs> Hmm? Not a problem. You gather your party before venturing forth. This is you so must dumb. Gather your party before venturing forth. Yes, it will be done. Ah! It's actually true that the dog don't know what they're doing. <laughs> I am sorry, brother. As That's the it. silver okay. moon waxes and wanes. So too does life. I take some solace in the fact that I die at your hand. Once more, light triumphs over darkness. Too bad there's never a bard around with the name one. It must be hard to kill your own brother. I hope I never have to do anything like that. <laughs> 
Sorry about your brother. Oh man, the subtlety. <laughs> Does he have any good loot on him? Sorry. All this time I thought my brother was dead. What misfortune brought us together again, only to prove he was lost to me. Perhaps this misfortune is a test of your faith. It wasn't misfortune, but fate. When Gamas turned to Shar, it was inevitable that he must face you one day. It is important to remember Gamas was lost in darkness long ago. Today you finally gave him peace. Beats me. Say, can we see the coast from up here? Let's have a look. The full moon shines brighter because we have longed for its light in the dark. Thank yeah, you for yeah. reminding me of the source found in the teachings of Selene. What is this? Whatever they need. <laughs> Nobody can use it. Only usable by Rassan. Yay. Uh, like as you can see, what he had was pretty good. And this was also working on this. This gives plus two damage even on long range weapon. For some reason, I thought it wouldn't work on that, but that's I specify. stand ready. So yeah, it will be done. Okay, Rasad finished, but Dorn uh, is not finished for reasons. Ah, oh, he, might, he might have a secondary quest. Because most of them have two quests. This guy only had one, but that was a huge quest. Plus all the stuff he talks to you about. Uh, I think we're gonna call it a night right here at the top of. Uh, of the Cloud Peak Mountains. It's pretty cool. The view is kind of meh. They could have done something way better than this. Oh yeah, I want to test my theory of this here. Let's go somewhere else. Like to Cloud Peak. With ease. Yeah, look at that! Look! Camaraderie, adventure, and steel on steel. Go for the eyes, Go for the Look how different it is. It's actually much better. Look at that. Like if I load or if I just go. Uh, yeah, here. It's a good Please. example. Like, this is what it's supposed to look like when it's unexplored. Instead of. Oh, we don't have it here. With ease. Oh, here it's actually normal. It's okay here. Uh, Calping themselves. Like, look how it is. All jaggy and kind of 3D ish. Not a problem. Cheap! Cheap! It's mal fait en Chris. Let's jump into someone else's stream and we'll be playing more Baldur's Gate on uh, Monday at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. The only thing that's left before we jump into Tales of the Sword Coast content. Hey Nix, good night to you. Uh, is uh, the side quest of What's his name? A character that I have never used. Never even talked to. 
uh, by a lost berry till, which is chaotic evil. So I'm not sure we'll be able to have a quest with him. Maybe quests. Oh, he has no quests. That guy has no quests. Okay. So that's it. Really? No quests. Okay, so that means that uh, he is a draw also, that guy. Uh, that means that next time we're going to visit Ulgurds B. Ulgurds. 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 Beards. And, um, man, that echo sound, I mean, that's just atrocious. Anyways. I really think it's like the... <laughs> Later, guys. Good night, DRS base. Rez and anybody else who's still in the, the chat. Um, Raid creature. It's playing Marvel Nemesis Rise of the Imperfects. No idea what that game is. So thanks for watching everyone. Have a great night. See you maybe. Um will I stream tomorrow? I don't think so. Uh, there's going to be a movie night um, on Discord. We're going to watch Rollerball if you're interested. It's at 8 p.m. Eastern time or about 8 p.m. Might be 8.15, 8.30. 8 8.30 at the latest, maybe something like that. Uh, do note that starting March 14, I will be advancing uh, one hour here in Quebec. If you don't change your time, Streams might appear one hour earlier than usual. Fuck time changes. Fuck time zones. Thank you for watching. Have a great night. Ciao. Thank you for your cooperation. Good night. I'll buy that.